good morning and welcome back to my channel today we are going to do another full day of eating or what i eat on ww freestyle um it is 6 21 got a little bit of a late a slow start this morning not late just slow i um wasn't feeling good this morning because i ate crap last night um you know my plan was to have pizza last night after my weigh-in i had plenty of points for it um and I, I, you know, I saved my points because I've been dying for pizza. I ate it. And then I ate a little party mix that I bought for my kids. And then I had something else. What did I have? I don't remember. Oh, I had a fun size Hershey bar dipped in peanut butter. Um, so, yeah, I definitely used the 20 points I had left plus some weeklies. Um, I... Usually, I had like 40 weeklies left, so I just used, I counted the weeklies that I didn't use the week before and called it a wash, um, but I felt like crap this morning. I felt like crap last night, and I felt like crap this morning. The pizza is just not sitting well, and I so did not want to get up and work out because I felt yucky, but I did it. I trudged through. I didn't do quite three miles. I did like 2.8 um, because I was moving a little bit slow this morning and needed to get moving and then did um, an eight fit workout and then I decided to do um, I saw somebody posted on my Facebook group I forget who it was and I apologize in advance for forgetting um, somebody posted a 30 day plank and squat challenge so I decided to add that in as well and the the plank was is starts off pretty easy day one is 15 seconds and during my eight fit workout which was reps today. I actually had to do planks a couple times for 30 seconds. So I just double dipped and counted that. Um, but then I did my 50 squats. Um, so that was my workout this morning. Got my husband's lunch pack, got coffee and tea made. And now I am going to go take a well-deserved shower because I need it and get my day started. Um, the way I feel right now, it's gonna be a pretty light day of eating. Cause like I said, I just feel bleh. And I've really been bad this last, like two weeks about getting my water in and it's nobody's fault but my own my water bottle that I love so much the batteries ran out and I keep forgetting to get new ones and they're not standard batteries they're button batteries and I mean it's as easy as a click on Amazon and they're here tomorrow or you know I've been to the store I just keep forgetting so I am definitely definitely getting those batteries today because that water bottle honestly does help me drink my water just because I'm very competitive against myself so it does help, um, but I am definitely getting all of my water in today, no matter what, because I feel like I really, really need it. Um, and that's it. Like I said, I'm gonna go get my shower and get my day started. Um, if you hear that music in the background, it is my husband doing his workout. Where? There he is. Um, he also does the eight fit and Jillian Michaels, and he doesn't run as much as I do, um, but he does do some running in there. But anyway, oh, real quick before I go get my shower, um, I have one more shout out to give to Lexi Pasidi. Um, wanted a shout out. Thank you, Lexi, for watching my channel. It's funny, guys. I'll give you some backstory. When I started this, you know, my boys were so proud of me because, you know, they're um, 19 and 17, almost 18. They're all into that. You, you know, they're, they are the YouTube generation. I mean, they, they love YouTube and they just thought it was so cool that I was starting a channel. Well, they promoted me so much to all of their friends. And I'm like, guys, your friends don't want to watch a 50 year old woman cook. Well, actually they do. And it cracks me up because they actually watch my videos. Um, you know, one night or one day we were sitting here and you know, his friend, I think it, it might've been Lexi, um, Snapchatted him and said, just watched your mom's meal plan video. And I said to him, well, ask her, tell her, quick quiz, what are we having for dinner tonight? And she replied back, salmon and sweet potatoes. So I thought it was kind of funny that they actually do watch my channel. You know, his friends will walk in and go, hey, mom and dad, I saw you're having this for dinner. I'm coming over. And I just crack up that these teenagers watch me. But anyway, way off topic as usual. So I will be back in a little bit with what I'm having for breakfast. 15 and I am just getting around to eating breakfast honestly I wasn't even hungry until now and 
I'm just starting to get a little bit hungry and I don't want to eat too much later than this. Um, I think it was all that crap I ate last night. Anyway, my breakfast is French toast in a mug. It is two freestyle smart points. Um, the recipe, I've had this a million times and it's linked down in the description box below and it will take you right to my website. I did throw some raspberries and strawberries in it this time, topped it with two tablespoons of sugar-free syrup and a squirt of Ready Whip. So there is my breakfast. Okay, I had a little break in my day so I decided to run outside and do some gardening. And now I am going to turn you around and show you how wonderful it is growing. In our back row here, we have our cucumbers. Look how big they're getting. They are huge. I cannot believe it. Everything is growing so nicely. We have our pepper plants, eight of them right here. We have three different varieties. And we even have, I don't know if you can see, a little pepper starting. And then back here we have our zucchini. And we've got lots. Let me see if I can find some good ones to show you. We've got lots of zucchini starting. In these two rows, we have 15 tomato plants, all different varieties. Most of the plants already have small green tomatoes on them that'll be getting bigger and ripening. Our little lettuce patch, we've been picking lettuce like crazy and it's still going nuts. This romaine plant has been growing up instead of out. It's crazy. Um, we just pick leaves off as we need them. There's some butter lettuce. This is mustard lettuce. It's got a really interesting flavor. Then we've got some red leaf. And then back here we have our eggplants that are already flowering. Up near the house, I'll show you my herbs. Here I just have some herbs in pots. I have parsley. Um, this is chives. They're just starting to come up. I mean, you can barely see them. We planted those a little bit later. I have my dill, my cilantro, and my basil's growing crazy. So there is my herbs and my garden. Two o'clock and time for lunch. Honestly, I'm not that hungry. Um, breakfast really filled me up and I didn't eat until late. So I am just having the leftover egg roll in a bowl that I made on Monday. That was filmed for a collaboration video of low point meals that will be released on Friday. So keep an eye out for that. But that's what I'm having for lunch, my low point um, lunch from Monday, which is egg roll in a bowl. I'll probably have some fruit and I made jam this morning. So I'm dying to taste it. So I might have a piece of jam and toast too later after I finish this. We'll see how it goes. I'm just gonna end my lunch with a little bit of mixed fruit, some cantaloupe, watermelon, and pineapple. So here I am back with my dinner and it is the taco pie. Normally this will be five points. I'll show you how I'm gonna garnish it. But I added um, two tablespoons of my favorite orange queso cheese on there, so that's going to add a point. But I'll be taking away five points for my Mexican rice because I cannot believe this. I was out of rice. I don't run out of rice. We are a rice family. I always have a ton of rice. I ran out. So, I made cauliflower rice. I happen to have a bag of rice cauliflower. I made cauliflower Mexican rice. I tasted it. It's really not bad. You know, I'm not a fan if you watch my channel, but it's really not bad. But I used Aldi brand of the Rotel and it is so hot I can't eat it. That's why there's a dollop of fat-free Greek yogurt on there, hoping to cut down on the spice a little bit. And one other thing real quick. Yes, I have a Christmas tablecloth on the table because all my other tablecloths and placemats are in the wash. That is why we have a Christmas tablecloth on the table. Yeah, I know. It, it, guys, it's real life around here. I've told you that before. So anyway, ooh, sorry. To garnish our taco pie, I am going to use the mix that is, oh, sorry, I'm trying to do this with one hand and hold the phone, and yeah, it's not working out well. This is the sour cream and taco sauce mix. It's fat-free sour cream and taco sauce, and that is already counted into the points. And then I'm sorry, just gonna garnish it with some lettuce. 
and tomatoes. And there we have the taco pie. And now it is the Mexican cauliflower rice. I know a lot of you were asking for that recipe when you saw it on my meal plan video. I'm gonna need to tweak it with the real rice and figure things out. But I promise I will get that up on the website. So now my dinner ends up being six, six smart points because the cauliflower rice is zero and the taco pie is now six points because of my queso. So there is my six point dinner. So this is how I ended my night, but I forgot to record it. I took a lemon smart cake, cut it in half, crumpled it up and made a lemon smart cake and fat free ready with parfait. Um, if you've never tried the smart cakes, they're okay. I, the company sent me some to taste test on a Facebook live. Um, and that's what I'm still working on. Would I buy them again? N no, because they're very, very expensive. And I can make something like a sweet treat much cheaper than it costs to buy these. And you know, my old line, whatever you do to lose the weight, you're going to have to do for the rest of your life to maintain it. And I'm not buying smart cakes for the rest of my life. I'm going to learn how to make a lower point treat. So anyway, but I did enjoy it. It was yummy. And that is it for my day. I am done eating. I am done everything. So I am calling it a night. It is 840. I am tired. I am going upstairs and I'm going to upload this video while I lay in bed. And I am hoping I will be in bed, tucked in and asleep by nine o'clock because 430 AM comes very early. Thank you for sharing my day with me. Thank you for supporting my channel. Um, I am overwhelmed by the amount of subscribers that I have in such a short time. I, I can't thank you enough. Um, you know, like, comment, share, please comment. I absolutely love reading your comments. That's like my favorite thing is reading your comments. Um, so anyway, like, comment, share, subscribe, share my channel. If you know someone who would like my content, share it. And that's it. That is my day of eating. Not very much today, pretty low point because like I said, after last night, I wasn't, I really wasn't hungry today. Um, so, you know, I did eat, I ate my points. I tried to get my food groups in. Um, I, I did okay with that, but anyway. Oh, and the taco pie, fantastic. The entire family liked it and I will admit, that the cauliflower rice wasn't bad. I still prefer real rice, but this was good in a pinch, except it was way too spicy for me and I really couldn't eat it. And I shouldn't be tapping on my arm while I'm holding my camera because it makes you jiggle. But see, I'm exhausted and I'm not thinking and now I'm rambling, so I am saying good night. Good night, everyone. I will see you in two days for a menu plan and grocery haul. Good night.